Hi everyone, Anthony Morganti here. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to remove a color cast with just one click. A year or two ago, I did a video demonstrating how to remove a color cast in Photoshop. It's a very effective method to remove a color cast, but it is a multi-step process. Recently, I received an email from Phil Anderson. He watched that video, and he told me that you could do the same thing with one click. And he went on to teach me how to do this method. Um, that kind of jogged a memory. A long time ago, five, six, seven years ago, I did a Photoshop video demonstrating how to remove a color cast with one click. But it's a different way than what Phil was talking about. So in this video, I want to show you both methods. And I'll also have a link to that video, that multi-step method, in the description below this video. It's good to know all three methods because what you'll find is one method will work great on one image, but it won't work so well on a different image. So it's good to know the other two methods. Hopefully one of those will work better on that other image. Now for this demonstration, what I'm going to do, I have my background layer. I'm going to duplicate it twice by hitting Command J on my Mac twice. It's Control J on a PC. That way we'll have one layer uh, for one method, the other layer for the second method, and then we'll have the background layer for comparison. So I'm going to turn off that top layer right now and click on this middle layer. And I'll show you the method that Phil told me first. And it, it's one click, but you have to get to it in a menu, okay? So you have to go up to Image, down to Adjustments, and then down to Match Color. And then see this little Neutralize checkbox? All you need to do is check that box and give it a second in there. It removed that blue color cast that is in the image. Now I'm gonna go back to the top layer and turn that one on. Now I'm gonna show you this method that I did a video on eons ago, it feels like at least. Uh, for this one, just go up to Image and then go to Auto Color right there. Just click on that and you can see it removed the color cast as well. Now it is slightly different. If I turn it off and we compare it to that first method I showed you, you could see that one is a little bit warmer. And if I turn this one back on, you could see this one's just slightly cooler. So maybe, you know, which one do you like better? And if we go and we just look at the original, there's the original with the blue color cast. There's the method that Phil told me how to use that is neutralize color. And there is just auto color. So now you know two more methods on how to remove a color cast in an image. Hopefully, I'll, these two, along with that other method, that first method I demoed a year or two ago, uh, you'll be able to remove a color cast in just about any image you happen to be working on. Thank you, Phil, for emailing me, and thank you, everyone, for watching my videos. I really do appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon.